Good morning, Box. I hope that you guys are having a lovely day. Um, I am taking advantage of the fact that Ken decided to spend the night last night because he got here so late to run out early in the morning and go grocery shopping because there are definitely some things that we need in the house um, and we don't really have any like food. We've got a couple of little like snacky things, but we need some proper food in the house and also some cleaning supplies and stuff like that too. So, I googled the nearest grocery store that also happened to have coffee, um, and I also edited a vlog, so hopefully that got up today. This store doesn't have Wi-Fi though, so it didn't get up when I thought it would, but we shall see. We shall see. Um, and we need to pick up some like deli meat or something. Apollo is on two medications for his foot. He's got an anti-inflammatory and also like a sedative and they're both painkillers. Um, but I tried to give him, I can't remember which one, one of them he'll just eat straight up and the other one I have to give to him like in one of those um, pocket pill treats and I used the last one up last night. So. Wow, milk is really cheap here. $1.89, that's awesome. Sorry, I'm distracted. So I'm thinking um, they might have some of them here, but if they don't, I'll just pick up some deli meat and wrap it in that. That'll probably be better because what he does is he eats the treat around the pill and then spits the pill out. So we'll find something for the little guy. So I'm swinging by Target really quickly. I saw um, a blanket and some sheets on clearance right after 4th of July that I want to see if they're on sale at this store too because um, our new place is furnished and the bed that we have is a king size bed and we're used to sleeping on a full so we don't have any bedding for it. So I'm like, okay, I'm going to just swing by Target and see... Oh, apparently I'm not. Oh no, they're open. And see if they have any king size bedding, because this was like really cheap. King size bedding can be very expensive, but it was on clearance. So we'll see what they have. And also I need to pick up some toiletries for the new house too. Okay, next mission, make friends. Uh, there's a baby wearing group today, so I'm taking the girls. All right, here we go. We're gonna go meet some new friends and check out a wrap or a carrier of some sort. Are you excited to see the baby wearers, Roslyn? Yeah, and to switch your shoes because they're on the wrong feet? Yeah. And Irene's asleep. I transitioned her without waking her up. Um, step one of making new friends has already started. I met some really great volunteer baby wearing educators there. I think I want to become one. So I talked to them a little bit and I helped another mom who had twins, um, kind of tandem wear with the help of a different educator. And I checked out this carrier, the Bamboo. So if you guys want to see a video on how to use that, I will try to post that soon. And I also met one of you. I met Carrie and her little baby girl, Kara. She was so sweet. She came up and was like, are you Heidi? And I was like, yeah. She's like, I watch you on YouTube. And so we had a little chit chat and um, it was just really great to meet her. And I met another girl named Angel. It was fun. It was so much fun. So get out of the house when you move. That's how you make new friends. I was trying to decide whether to go here or to La Leche League today because there was a La Leche League at the same time. But I was like, I've already paid for a membership at the baby wearing group and I'd rather check out a carrier. So I went here. <laughs> um, anyways, I'm going to go back to the house because Roslyn wants to eat and I want to start unpacking some of her toys because there's some that she's specifically asking for. But she was so good. She did so well playing with the other kids and found some Legos and uh, I love baby wearing. It's such a great group of people. Okay, my next project is to set up this closet which, um, this closet is ridiculously huge. Our old closet was like this, and this is like a room. I'm like, we should just put Irene in here. Of course we don't need to, because we have a den and a playroom, and we actually have an extra room too that we're not gonna use, um, because that has all of Ken's dad's stuff in here. But I think my next project is gonna be to go ahead and unload our stuff, so, or our clothes. So I think I'm gonna go ahead and do that. Maybe I'll time lapse it for you.
Okay, I got some of our clothes put away um, and started working on a little bit on Roslyn's. But when you do the clothes, it doesn't feel like you're making progress very quickly because it's just kind of like a redundant task. Um, and it only gets stuff into like a very small section of the house and then you don't see it again. So I feel like I've worked all day, but we still actually I have worked all day. What time is it? It's 5.50. I should cook dinner. Um, I worked right through lunch. Um, I feel like I've worked all day, but I still don't feel like I got as much done as I'd like to. So, <sighs> Roslyn wanted to play in here a little bit, so I figured I'd play and I'd vlog. Roslyn, do you want to show us your airplane? Um, he's driving. Who's driving? Um, he's driving. What's her name? Um, he's driving. She's driving? Yeah. Is the doggy driving? Um, Princess Emma driving. Princess Amber is driving? Yeah. Hey, guys. <laughs> guys, guys, guys. This plane was also left behind by Uncle Tay. It's so stuck. It's stuck. Do you need help? Yeah. Uncle Tay did move to Korea. Mm -hmm. And he left this airplane here. So now you get to play with it. Because we live here. This is our house. Yeah, we live here now. This is our new house. Hi, hi, mom. Did you have fun today? Yeah. Yeah. What was your favorite part? Um, she's baby wear. Oh, when we saw the baby wearers. Yes. Yeah. And I had fun pup and had fun other puppy. You had fun playing with the other Lego puppy. Yeah. Yeah. Can you say goodnight to the box? It's a fire puppy. Oh, it was a fire puppy? Yeah, it was a puppy that went on the Lego fire truck. The Lego fire truck. Okay, can you say goodnight to the box? Goodnight. Will you say subscribe? Say hi. And we'll talk to you tomorrow. Oh, thumbs up, you're right. Thumbs up. Bye. Woo. Bye. I just sounded like a goat. Bye, box. Have a good night.